answer in a function. psychology class. Function question. Okay, so today we'll look at a psychological phenomenon called the bandwagon effect and how it can affect our lives. Okay. The term bandwagon effect refers to the tendency of people to take on a behavior, style, or attitude because a lot of other people are doing it. It's a kind of social pressure. We feel the bandwagon effect when we want to do something because everybody's doing it. Professor, that seems like such a strange term for that phenomenon. Do you know where it comes from? I am just about to get to that. Now, the term bandwagon effect comes from uh, an actual wagon, the kind that's pulled by horses with an actual band of musicians on it. Back in the 19th century, circuses were a wildly popular form of entertainment. They traveled the country on wagons, and when a circus arrived in a new town, it would often parade down the main street with the band playing from the band wagon. During the 1848 presidential election, a circus leader named Dan Rice was supporting presidential candidate Zachary Taylor. Rice used his circus's bandwagon to carry Taylor around between different spots in a city when he gave campaign speeches. The bandwagon drew a lot of attention to the campaign, and soon the newspapers were encouraging other candidates to jump on the bandwagon, like Taylor. This ultimately led to bandwagons becoming common features of political campaigns. Nobody uses wagons anymore, but the phrase, jump on the bandwagon, is still used to refer to joining in with something that has become popular. Okay, here we go. Ah. Listen again to part of the lecture, then answer the question. Kind of the same thing as an ad. Professor, that seems like such a strange term for that phenomenon. Where does Do you know come? where it comes from? I am uh, right here. just about to get to that. What does the professor Why does mean? the professor say this? I am... Just about to get to that. This is it, right there, right there. I wrote it down on the left-hand side. He's just about to get to it. Why does he say that? He is going to answer the student's question. So what would the answer be? Is it, he's unsure about the origin of the term? He is now going to explain the origin of the term? He forgot to tell the student. What is it, you said B? Yes. B as in boy. Fantastic. Yes. That's how that Same works. Boy. Function questions are very similar to attitude, but you're not focused on the attitude of the professor. You're focused on what is he saying and why is he saying that, right? And so that is exactly mm -hmm. it. You can see my notes. Okay. My notes, I wrote down bandwagon effect. All right. And of course, if this is a just purpose question, what would this primarily be about? It's about a term, a bandwagon effect and, you know, how people react to it, I guess, you know. And so my I wrote down definition is to take on the behavior, all doing it based on social pressure. And then the student and I wrote down S on the left hand side, my main idea. Now, remember, main idea here, details over here. OK, so I wrote down student. Come from, professor, get to it. For some reason, something told me to write down what the professor said right there. And so sure enough, that is what I wrote down. So good, good. Let's do another one. Let's do another one. These are function questions. Very similar to attitude. Let's go. Listen 